Hey everybody, Morten here. This is day five of my fundraiser for the Norwegian Refugee Council. Um, I am still in California. As you can see, I'm in a studio at LinkedIn Learning doing stuff. So that's why the set is totally different. Um, today, I have a question from Slobodan and he asks, how much time do I need to master PHP enough to make a custom WordPress theme or plugin? See, okay, there, there are parts to this. So. First of all, you need to understand PHP, but you don't really need to be a PHP developer. And that's because WordPress has its own coding language is based on PHP. It's almost like an abstraction language. I call it the WordPress templating language or theming language. So for most PHP functions, there is um, a copy of it in WordPress that is a WordPress function that usually has a really easily understandable name. Um, a lot of the functionality in WordPress is also based around syntactically easy to understand um, function names like the post gives you the post and so on. So if you want to learn how to build WordPress themes, you don't actually need to learn PHP and be a PHP developer to get started. What you need to do is take an existing theme, usually one of the default themes in WordPress, and start messing around with it and pick it apart to see how it works and then learn how WordPress uses PHP to create things. Once you get the hang of how the WordPress templating language works, then you can start looking at how you can use PHP to extend it. Now you asked about both themes and plugins. So for themes, it's relatively easy because you can work around this templating language. When it comes to plugins, you probably have to learn more PHP, especially because plugins are moving more into the uh, object-oriented section of PHP, which requires a lot more um, learning. So I can't really give you a time. I can't say you need exactly a year or something like that. What I would say instead is learn on the job. Start with something simple, figure out how things work, and then figure out where you need to learn new things to get where you want to go. And approach your problems piecemeal. So take a small piece of something and try to figure out how that is solved in PHP and then add to it later. That way you'll move yourself through the learning process and you have a reason to learn things. So you're not just saying, I'm gonna learn PHP. You're saying, I have this problem, I need to figure out how to pro solve this problem in the best possible way, and I'm gonna learn how to do that, all right? So this is the AMA session for my fundraiser. That means you can ask your own questions or you can contribute to the fundraiser. In either case, just go to this URL here, click on the donate button to donate money, click on the ask a question button to ask a question and your question may appear in a future video. That's it, bye.